And with Mr. Bob Lupenta, who made the keynote donation to Iona College, the new school of business, why is this something you decided to invest in, sir? Well, uh, you know, I graduated from Iona in, I didn't want to mention it, but 1967. <laughs> and to me, Iona has always been, although it's a great liberal arts school, great programs in philosophy and science and literature and history, it's always been a business school. So recognizing that, there was one addition to this campus after everything that's been added that would bring this school to the 20, mid 21st century and beyond. And we're gonna educate over 40,000 students, give them a great education, get them out in the world so they could be successful and move the world. And to have my name associated with that, everybody's thanking me. I wanna thank everybody for giving me that opportunity. And sir, you mentioned uh, serving in the United States Navy. Tell yes. us a little bit about your career path in, in military service and then uh, through your business career. Well, you know, I graduated uh, from my owner in, in 67, and a week later, I, I uh, got my draft notice. And so I was fortunate. I went to the Navy. I got on my hands and knees. I begged them, uh, to, and he said, there's a three-year waiting list. I begged him. He gave me a book. He says, okay read this book, you come back on Monday, and we'll see what happens. I went back Monday, he walked in, he says, Ra raise your right hand, you're in the Navy. <laughs> it's great, he saved my life. I wish I knew where he was, Captain Hiscock. <laughs> and sir, maybe a little bit about your business career when you left. I started in, in public accounting, which is what I, I think, you know, everybody that gets into business at some point should have some knowledge of accounting of cash flows, of how to read a balance sheet, of how to read a cash flow. If you're on Wall Street, or if you're a, an engineer, or if you're in fashion and design, eventually business is gonna be important to you at some phase of your career. So I started in public accounting, and then I left and I went to a company called Loral that was in defense electronics, and we grew that from business and, and to form you know, relationships and, and camaraderie, so it's another, great addition to, to this campus. We also didn't have um, a Heinz Athletic Center, you know, back in 1999. You see it right there, the home for exercise and training and the home for our great basketball team that's been in the NCAA tournament um, for probably four out of the last eight years. And the library where we expanded it and, and in, you know, increased it in size and modernized it, where students can now go to study and do research and learn. <clears throat> but I think the biggest, the biggest uh, impact uh, is today. <laughs> <laughs> this, this school, this school will be the centerpiece of the Iona College campus. It will attract students from around the world to come here. The best students will be able to attract the best faculty to come here and get an education. And they're going to get the best business education in conjunction with the Heinz Entrepreneurial Leadership Institute, where we're going to be able to create the next entrepreneurs in the world. So it is with great pride, pleasure, I'm just so proud that me and my family could be connected with such a momentous event. Thank you so much. Endowed chairs. Today, that endowment is up to $150 million. And maybe with today's market up a little bit, it might be over. <laughs> so that, that was an increase of almost 950%. And it resulted from a good stock market, a good performance by the, the college financially, and some um, key donations by a number of our alumni and, and members of the Board of Trustees. So, the, also in 99, there, I don't think there was one um, Iona-owned uh, student um, dormitory. And we recently completed, across the street, a $40 million dormitory, and with that completion, we now have over 1,500 beds to provide housing for students that now come from across the country, and in many cases, from around the world. A tremendous, tremendous accomplishment.
you know, I graduated from my own in, in I didn't want to mention it, but 1967. <laughs> and to me, Iona has always been, although it's a great liberal arts school, great programs and philosophy and science and literature and history, it's always been a business school. So recognizing that, there was one addition to this campus after everything that's been added that would bring this school to the 20, mid 21st century and beyond. And we're gonna educate over 40,000 students give them a great education, get them out in the world so they could be successful and move the world. And to have my name associated with that, everybody's thanking me. I want to thank everybody for giving me that opportunity.